guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to another Slash My Stash. So today we are going to be de-stashing some of my very original polishes in my collection, which is my Nicole by OPI collection. I've been hanging on to these bad boys for a long time. Some of them are probably pretty hard to find. I remember even before I started my channel, these were some of the polishes that I really started picking up. I felt like they did a lot of interesting things. Nicole by OPI was like OPI's younger sister, where they got to try all of their fun, cool colors out, and I felt like OPI was kind of boring. So these girls have been hanging out with me for a long time, but as you know on my Slash My Stash series, I'm trying to de-stash my nail polish collection because it's getting to be bigger than I can handle, and I want to send polishes out to people who will wear them and love them and have the space for them and things like that. So on my series of Slash My Stash, we look at everything. I give you a speed swatch of things. Well, I'm giving myself a speed swatch of it because after I swatch it and look at the polish on my nail using the nail wheel, I make myself make a decision at that point after seeing it on myself and seeing the formula if I really want to hold on to it. If something just doesn't call out to me and I know I'm going to miss it once it's gone, then I go ahead and let go of it. These are hard decisions, especially this collection of polishes, you guys. Like I said, they've been with me a long time. And so anyway, everything you're looking at today has pretty much only been swatched once for my channel. I swatched it on my channel, reviewed it, or put it in a swatch fest, and then I put it in my Helmer and just didn't wear it again. After I make all my decisions, I will list everything on my Store Envy D-Stash website. Everything up there is very gently used, like I said, maybe one swatch or two swatches, and the, everything is priced for about half of what I purchased it for. So you guys, that's about it for the intro. Let's go ahead and get to swatching. Okay, we're gonna start out with this pink, a Like Haley story from the Modern Family collection. I think I purchased all of that collection. It is really, really beautiful, but because it's pink, I know I probably won't ever think of it again, so I'm gonna list that. A Phil's Paradise, this is a really pretty, like, chromey silver with some gold, but I will probably list that. Next we have Court is Ready for a Petty. I think I also purchased all of the Kardashian collaboration. This is a gorgeous red. Um, in my collection it doesn't really stand out as, you know, it's not calling to me, so I'll list it, but that is a really, really pretty red. Anise Treat. This is from the Gumdrops collection of textured polishes. Um, this is just a pretty black textured polish, and um, yeah, it's nice. See, it's cute, but I think I'm going to list it. Next we have another pink. This is from the Selena Gomez collection. So Nicole I hope I did a lot of fun things. A lot of fun collaborations. Spring break. I am going to go ahead and list that. Kind of a perfect Barbie pink. Chloe had a little lamb lamb. This is a really beautiful, very dark teal that, um, yeah, I think I will list that one as well. Hey, I'm doing pretty good, guys. Next up we have Cinnamon of My Dreams, also from the Gumdrops collection. This one is a cool red with some gold in it. Again, a textured polish. I will list this one as well. Stand By Your Manny from the Modern Family collection. Hmm, this is just a very soft, beautiful periwinkle with some shimmer. I'll go ahead and list that. It is really, really cute though. I'm stuck on you. Another textured collection. This is from the Ruffles collection, or I never really knew how to pronounce that. <laughs> it looks like Ruffless. Um, hmm. I'm undecided on that because that is really, really unique in my collection. I shop Mintage. This is a beautiful, kind of crellyish, squishy minty green. Oh, I guess I didn't have a picture of that for you. Um, I'll probably list that mint. American as apple pie. Again, just a gorgeous classic red. That's from the Carrie Underwood collection. I will go ahead and list that one as well. Rock the Look from the Ruffles collection. This is cute. Um, I'll probably list this one because it's pink, but I thought that that whole collection was really, really fun. So I'm still trying to decide on that purple one, but I will list this one. Back to reality dot 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 TV. I think this was from... The Kardashian collection, a purple with a beautiful pink shimmer. Way to rock that shimmer glow. Um, I'll list this one. It is really pretty though. 
Hit the lights. I will keep this polish. As you know, I kind of um, collect yellow polishes and I can never have enough yellow. So I'm gonna hold on to this one. Hit the lights. It has a great, great two coat formula. Lay it on the line. Um, that might have been a typo. Is it lay it on the lime, maybe? This is pretty. I think I like that one even better than the mint, so I'm gonna hold on to that one. Uh, back to my Gloria days, again from the Modern Family Collection. A beautiful, shimmering, like almost plummy purple. I will list this one on my D stash. Heavenly Angel from the Selena Gomez Collection. A iridescent flaky topper. Fun! I'm gonna list that. I forgot that they had done that polish. My Cherry Amore from the Gumdrops Collection. So a beautiful, deep berry textured polish, which I will list. Next up, we have another from the Gumdrops Collection. That's what I mint, which looks more like a sea green, and it has green and blue shimmers in there, I can see. That's really fun. I am gonna list that, though. Gold Texture. Gold Texture, huh? That's the name of it? I feel like that one was a a crackle polish. I'm not sure. I will list it. On what grounds from the Ruffles collection? This whole collection, I like it, I think, more than their other gumdrops collection. But I will list that one. Carried away from the Carrie Underwood collection. This is a, just a very beautiful, delicate, gold, shimmery polish, which I'll go ahead and list. Sealed with a Chris from the Kardashian collection. This is a very deep, Sexy blood red kind of a crelly jelly formula. I will list that I Lilac gumdrops from the gumdrops collection Hmm, That one has some really beautiful glowy kind of shimmer. Let me see how it looks on Um, I might hang on to that one That was kind of cool sand in my shoe from the ruffles collection. I think this is I'll definitely keep this one So I'm either gonna keep this and the purple or just this one that is just totally unique to my collection. I have nothing else like that. So I'll hang on to that. Luke of the Draw from the Modern Family Collection. That is really pretty actually. Very dark with black, very dark black with silver glitters. I'll probably list that, but it's really cool. Purple Yourself Together. Another purple with shimmer. This time it's a gold shimmer. That is really, really pretty. Um, I think I'm going to list it, even though I really like it a lot, but I'm going to try to be good. I'll list that one. Scarlet from the Selena Gomez Collection, a deeper kind of fuchsia pink with shimmer, which I will list. Am I making myself Claire from the Modern Family Collection? This one's going to stick with me. This one's making the cut. <laughs> I just really love that color, you guys. I kind of am crazy about it. So I'm going to hang on to that. Blueberry Sweet on You from the Gumdrops Collection. Ooh, I like this. Maybe I'll hang on to that one. I'm gonna decide between that and the purple one, I think, and just keep one from the Gumdrops Collection. What's the Mituation from the Modern Family Collection? This one was kind of like a duochrome, but it didn't really shift that much. I'll go ahead and list it. I feel like in extreme lighting it, it shifted, but it's not showing up there. My J or the Highway is a really cool, like, dirty stone brown-gray hybrid. I think I'll list it, but that one's kind of cool. This green is a scream, a neon yellow lime. Oof. I don't know. I gotta decide between that and the other lime I said I was gonna keep. If they're very, very similar, I'll only keep one. If they're different... <laughs> I'm gonna keep both. Candid Cameron, another kind of duochrome one. That one has better formula. Um, I'll probably still list it. Even though I love Cam, Alex by the Books is a pretty sea green kind of squishy formula. I will list it. Oh, that has great coverage. I'm gonna list that one though. There's a really pretty color. Sweet Dreams from the Selena Gomez collection. She did some fun polish in that collection. It's a beautiful glitter topper with blue, green, and purple, which I will list, but that's really fun. Lemon Lolly. I'm gonna hang on to this. This is from the Gumdrops collection. Okay, so I already said I'm gonna keep the blue. Maybe I'll just keep the blue and the yellow. 
Okay, Love Song from the Selena Gomez collection. This color of purple is so beautiful. Oof. I think I will list it, but that color does really call to me. My Claim to Flame. I think this was just... I don't think this was from a specific collection. Wow, I think I like that even better than the other two reds. I'm going to go ahead and list it, but that is really, really pretty. Paparazzi Don't Preach from the Kardashian collection. Just a beautiful peach. Yeah, that's gorgeous. Peach cream. I'll list it. I can go ahead and part with it. Goodbye Shoes from the Carrie Underwood collection. A slightly teal tinted gray, which is really, really pretty. Oh, that looks gorgeous on. I might have to keep that one. I'll have to look at the end and see how many I've kept. Did he wink at me? The final polish and look at that gorgeous purple. Wow, that is pretty. I think I will go ahead and list it. Here are all the polishes that I am going to de-stash and let go of. These are the things that will be up on my store and V site when I get everything loaded from this video and from the Julie G video. And then here are the polishes that I am going to keep. So these are the little ladies that are gonna be staying with me that I just felt like I was gonna miss too much if I let them go. I really hope that if you see something here that you like, that you're able to snag it at the D stash. I think that's about everything for today, you guys. Thanks for being here. I hope you enjoyed this. I will see you back for the next one very soon. Bye.